Adding a watermark to your presentation is a great way to establish copyright and or corporate identity and protect your content from unauthorized use. Let's see how to add a watermark using PowerPoint's built-in features. First, go to the View tab and click Slide Master. Now go to the Insert tab, click Shapes, and choose a rectangle. Draw the rectangle on the area of the slide where you want the watermark to appear, then right-click it and go to Format Shape. On the right-hand panel, open the Fill options and choose Picture or Texture Fill. Now click File to find your watermark. Resize the shape to conform to the picture's dimensions. If you like, you can also change the image's transparency to blend with your slides. Now click Close Master View to return to the presentation and check the results. One drawback to the PowerPoint method is that the watermark may not always show through images on your slide, and it will also be covered by any special content you insert with iSpring, like YouTube videos, web objects, and flash movies. The easiest way to add a watermark to all your slides with consistent quality and appearance is to use an iSpring PowerPoint-based authoring tool like iSpring Suite. When your presentation is ready, just click Publish on the iSpring toolbar and go to the Protection tab. Check the option Add Watermark and select a picture such as your company logo. Now you can adjust the position and transparency of the watermark. You can also specify a link that will open every time a user clicks the watermark. Just check this option and indicate the web page. If you want the link to open in a new browser window, check the option on the right. To protect your presentation with a password, check the password option and enter the password twice. To set time restrictions, select the start date and the end date of your presentation's allowed playback window. You can use one of them or apply both. Finally, you can set domain restriction to allow playback on the websites that you specify in the field below. After you adjust all publishing settings, click Publish. When your presentation is opened, the user will be prompted for a password, and the watermark will be displayed on all your slides. Did you like this video? Give it a like and subscribe to the iSpring YouTube channel for more updates.